Okay, so on the 64 Impala, looking to uh, start the grill removal process. Not quite sure, <clears throat> excuse me, how in depth it's going to be. So I'm uh, going to get started and see what we can find. I think there are some bolts um, uh, from what I've read on a couple of different forums under the fender skins. So uh, I want to kind of start there, see what we can see underneath, and take it from there. See what we can uh, do about getting this uh, off today. All right, so on the 64 Impala, um, most of the fender bolts come out rather easily. There's this one up front, um, right in front of this area, under the uh, front fender toward the bumper side. And there's also these two, this one here on the bottom, and this one here, for me, that were pretty much rusted solid. And... Basically, uh, let me show you, this uh, bolt is actually going into a clip which had come loose of the actual bracket assembly, so it was just in there kind of free spinning. So if you go on the underside of the fender here, you can actually get a wrench on there, or I tried uh, channel locks, but they didn't work as well as a wrench did once I got it in the right position. Also, this bottom bolt just continued to spin and spin and spin and I couldn't get anything on the other side. So what I wound up doing is just get a real big um, thick screwdriver and just stuck it in between this bracket and the fender and uh, just kept pulling down and down and it's actually is just about out at this point. A couple more turns and it'll be out. So that pretty much seems to leave me with <clears throat> this front bolt as the only one left and it's right <laughs> i'm staring at it but i can't find it on the camera and that way it works sometimes yeah that's it right there sorry it just kind of blended in same color so that is one on the front and that seems to be really tight so i'm gonna see if i can get that off i'm not sure this brace is uh, part of what's uh holding the finished skin i'm not sure if that is actually attached there or not so once i get that front one out um and finish this back bolt which is just about done well, hopefully we'll be able to get the skin out now i don't have a lift or anything either so i'm not sure if the skin will fit out with uh, the tire in place so i might have to jack it up and remove the tire i'll let you know all right so on that uh front uh, fender bolt if you actually go under the front bumper area you can get to that really easily get a lot more pressure on it at this point that's all but out um, but this skin actually goes around and wraps to the front from the way I see it here so we got those three bolts then it wraps around to the underside of the grill area so uh, we'll get those five bolts, six bolts taken out, and uh, we'll pick you back up and see if that actually loosens that entire inner fender skin.